It has been so surreal to make it this far in the competition, and it's just almost like a dream come true for me. My freshman year, I went off to school, but my parents got divorced about two years ago. Clear those trees on that lot, all right? OK. I dropped out, and I'm working construction jobs to help my family and be the man in our house. It's pretty crazy to be out there on stage. <laughs> How am I going to compete with all these people? I have two younger adopted siblings and one younger brother. We really have a tight bond. Dominic, do you have your shoes? Yeah. Doing well in this competition means just trying to work as hard as I can to help support my family and do what I love. Everything in me, my heart, my soul, just wants to be a musician. Right now, my hands definitely look like workmen's hands, but I hope one day that they're just musicians' hands. Coming up now. Okay, let's hear from the judges. Heidi, see that big smile again. <laughs> well, I think that you were really, really smart singing a beloved Beatles song. You know, I think that's why also you had the crowd going immediately. You won us all over, and you're adorable. I think it's fun for you to do a different kind of, you know, song. You were rocking it out today. The last time it was just you and the guitar, so it was nice for a change. I think you're really good, and not too bad on the eye. Mel B. Well, so you're still a mommy's boy, right? <laughs> yes, ma'am. You, you still cook, right? <laughs> yes, ma'am. Oh, well, that was just one hot performance. <laughs> I mean, what else can I say? You chose the right song. It was a proper show. You rocked it. You looked good. You sang well. Check, 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 and check. <laughs> Howie, you know, here's what I got to say to you, Miguel. I know. And I, t and I keep saying it, I know who watches the show, but not only who watches the show, all of America watches the show, but I know who votes. And if this was not only the finale of the first live show, but if this was the last act we see, I think that performance would win the one million dollars. I really believe that. Wow. I think, you know, 
uh, people can argue that maybe, maybe you're not the best singer they've ever heard. Maybe not the best performer. But you are the package they're looking for. You are a superstar. You are the one in one direction. You are the person. No, but, but it's absolutely true. And I know I'm on Twitter all the time, at Howie Mandel. Oh, and please! <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I'm going to uh, I'm going to rain on the parade a little. Bit. Oh, sorry. sorry. Okay. I hate to bring the party to a halt. Miguel, I like you very much. I think you're, uh, first of all, you're a very good-looking guy, and you do have star quality. When you look in the camera, I can feel the girls going wild. Uh, I think you picked a great song, and and I think your band is great. And yet, I felt the performance lacked some charisma. You had the unfortunate experience of following Emily West who sometimes can turn a song on like that. I think, I think you might go through because of your charisma and your looks, but the problem is I want you to really, really think about what I'm saying. I think you've got to do something vocally that blows us away and find your identity and get clear on it. I do think you need a little bit of help there. But you're a very nice guy and your story is very compelling. And we'll see what happens, Miguel. Yeah. All right, Miguel, now, uh... A bunch of different opinions here at the judges' table. How do you feel you did? You know, I felt good. And if I'm here, when I'm here, hopefully next, next time, I'm going to win you over, Howard. All right, so. I'm waiting for that. <laughs> okay, America.